Fashion designer Kitty Nathan has always found inspiration in Maori patterns for her spectacular kākahu. She designed the cloak Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern wore recently to Queen Elizabeth's funeral and was inducted into the New Zealand Hall of Fame for women entrepreneurs last year. Last night, a crowd gathered in Glen Innes for the opening of Te Ahuru Mōwai, including some very special guests for Kitty Nathan's new community hub, which she hopes will foster a new generation of Māori designers and creatives. Here's Te Rito journalism cadet Aroha Nui West with the story. A new premises for Māori designer Kitty Nathan. No, actually, but I don't think we could ever reach our full potential unless we had enough space and the right machinery and the right tools to really start producing what I keep calling uh, in a grown-up fashion designer way. <laughs> The name of the building, Te Ahuru Mōwai, meaning a shelter or haven, which is the exact intentions of this whare. The fact that my husband and I could come up with an idea and see it come alive. The fact that uh, Māori designers will be able to come in here and use the, the sample room and use the photo suite and that they'll get support that we didn't. The Glen Innes raised fashion guru is excited to give back to her community with her new creative space located in the heart of the East Tamaki suburb. Okay, G GI. Um, so I grew up in GI and tonight many of my like, lifelong friends from primary, intermediate and college are here to celebrate and they were the ones that came in to help, you know, totoko and build this place out and so, I don't know, there's just, there's so much to be grateful for and there's so much love immersed into this tiny space in this tiny little town in the middle of Tamaki Makoto that means so much to me. Her designs have been worn by the likes of Meghan Markle, President Barack Obama and Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern and she hopes to support a new generation of Māori fashion designers. So next year we will be starting to roll out programs and initiatives in the local community. We want to start up enterprise, enterprise programs uh, through primary, intermediate and college here where we take all our offcuts of fabrics and then we teach the kids how to make small things and build them small business models so that they can start ticking over in their head what the basics of business are and also in the same time while they're thinking about commercial ventures, they're thinking about the planet. Kitty Nathan created this space and hopes that it will be a hub for Māori and Indigenous designers. A collaboration with her husband Jason, a Ponamu Kaba, and says that there is space to teach Angatahi Māori here in Glen Innes. Arohanui West, Tiao Tapatahi.